of course, you know, there's a lot of fuss about him being Bobby's grandson and oh, and you Kennedy and so on. You've covered him uh, since he started in, in politics and since he was elected. What, I mean, is he actually that good as people are saying that he is or is it uh, also getting a little bit uh, more heat that it can actually take because of the fact that he's a Kennedy? Well, he's a Kennedy, but he's also half Anglo-Saxon. <laughs> and being an Anglo-Saxon, I love to tell the Kennedys, it's really he was raised by his mother. Um, he's a very bright, very serious uh, uh, about issues. He loves to tackle issues. He's one of the more boring political people to have lunch with because he wants to talk about issues <laughs> and not about the politics. Uh, and uh, he, he's also very bright and, and um, very bright. And he does, he really is uh, focused on his job uh, and he's very popular and he knows politics. He gets, he does have a little Irish in him because he understands the politics of, of Boston. But, um, and he's doing, uh, I think he's, he's been very smart. Uh, he, he doesn't try to promote himself. He's gone to Congress at the, just in the first, uh, what, four years now that he's been there, uh, six years, I guess now. Yeah, six years, uh, he is uh, smart in working across the aisles, finding out how things work, how politics works. This is his first political job. Mm -hmm. I mean, he ran his uncle Ted Kennedy's uh, Senate campaign at one point, but this is real, you know, negotiations, Congress, arm twisting, uh, finding common ground. And um, I, I think he's been very impressive in, in the sense that he has not really promoted himself and that he's really trying to learn the craft of... Uh, being a being a congressman and the politics that's involved, uh, so he he's uh, he's he's the future. When is his question? It's very difficult to move up, and everybody wants to be the next U.S. senator from Massachusetts. 